Welcome to the project demonstration of fruit harvesting robot using 4 degree of arm. So in this project we are using 12 volts 2 amp battery. So here we can see this is a 12 volts 2 amp battery. Each battery has a 4 volt 1 amp capacity. So uh, we are adding the 4 volts uh, battery 4 volts batteries in a series. So it will become 444 4, 4 is equal to 12 with a, uh, so in a series your voltage will be added and current will be same. So that's why it is 12 volt 1 amp. So if we add the 12 volt 1 amp in a parallel it will become uh, 12 volts 2 amp battery in a parallel connection current will be added and voltage will be same now this uh, battery is a 12 volt 2 amp battery and also using a l 9 3d arduino uno board and two ir sensors so here we can see a two ir sensors which follow the line and also we, we are using a lm2596 buck converter is a buck converter it takes 12 volts 2 amp power supply it will step down up to 5 volts of power supply that 5 volts of power supply will be given to this track pcb at the same time we are uh, giving the 5 volts power supply to this arduino uh, sorry raspberry pi 0w so here we can see raspberry pi 0w also so here we can see uh, track pcb taking the 5 volts power supply from the lm2596 that 5 volts will be, will be equally divide the 5 volts to the this IR sensors and the servo motors like that and also we can see here there will be a Pi camera and a Pi, uh, Raspberry Pi 0W so Pi camera will be uh, process the image or a fruit so if it is processed then it will be cut the fruit using this cutter so this is the arm so here we can see in the arm we are having a three servo motors so one is for the base one is for the middle one top and down and another one is for the cut the fruit we are using this uh, servo motor as a cutter and also using a buzzer in a monitoring time buzzer will be give a noise with the time delay and also we are using a charging circuit so here you can see a charging circuit in the charging circuit we have a uh, step up transformer and the bridge rectifier so we are providing the power supply through this power cable it takes 230 volts of power supply that will be given to this primary of the transformer and the secondary of the transformer have a 12 volt 1 amp so it will step down up to 12 volt 1 amp that will be given to this rectifier input so rectifier converts ac to dc so it is taking the input ac 12 volts and will be converting up to 12 volt 1 amp dc that will be given to this 12 volts 2 amp battery so we are using this charging as a charger as a to charge the battery now the battery have a low charge so that's why we are using a charging circuit now so uh, coming to the working and the aim of this project so this project will be this uh, IR sensor will be follow the lines at the same time this IR sensor if any detected in an object near to like this port then automatically this it will be send a message to this Arduino board then Arduino board will give a uh, signals to the servo motors the servo motors will be uh, up like that like this and after that this IPI camera will be calculate the uh, image process the image if the image is true then automatically this cutter will be cut the fruit so cutted fruit will be placed on this in this box so coming to the aim so it will be line follow the robot and it will be cut the fruit automatically using the image processing so let, let me see how it will be works so when we on the power supply this robot will be follow the line at the same time this if it is ir sensor detected the robot will be stopped and this gripper will be come upside and process the image if the image is true then automatically this cutter will be cut the fruit then fruit will be down in this box then automatically it will down again and it will follow the line continuously let will see how it will be works now uh, we are starting power supply so using this switch we need to power on the power supply so we can see here clearly so it will be initialized so this is the initial position of this more project so if the after the initialization of this uh, raspberry pi they will give a capital a to this arduino you know then arduino you know follow the lines 
so now you can see it is processing the image In this way, it will cut the food, and again, it will follow the line continuously. So, it will be cut the food six times. So, in this way, it will follow the fruit. So, in this way, this part will be works. Thanks for the watching.